the effects inside the wires. So first step inside the wires, I've created a small mask to see the wires itself. I will create a mask to make the FX appear. So first step is to create this mask, link it here and with Alt B I choose the brush here. I'm inside the camera so I can see my element. Increase with the O my brush size and draw one drawing like this. I change my element to the rotation. I I just noticed that I might have forgotten a lot of key of uh, shortcuts I've used uh, until here. So just to remember, creating a peg is Control P. Creating a composite is Control H. Using a new drawing, uh, creating a new drawing is Control R. Um, when I want to cut and paste, uh, copy paste something, uh, Control C, Control V, but I have the past special which is here. We can allows you to create a new drawing or a new column, a new peg uh, is Control B on my uh, keyboard. So these ones are the main uh, uh, shortcuts I am using, but I am also managed to create new shortcuts to go from last to first frame to last frame with two shortcuts that I've created, then first and next frame and previous frame with other shortcuts. I also managed to add shortcuts from keyframe to keyframe so these ones are my own. I'm used to work with them like this, so you you shall be able to do it on your own. Oh sorry, another shortcut. Control U is for the preferences and inside you can just select and once you've selected something you change the shortcut hit like this and so be careful while using because changing because as you can see they are lots and lots and lots of shortcuts inside Harmony so you might destroy something while uh, creating a new one so be really careful about wh what you do and uh, I've created so for these ones uh, I really need to jump from uh, position, rotation and scale so I used Alt 1, 2, 3, 2, 3, 4, 5 which are my main tools of compositing. For me it's really important so that I can work more efficiently. So forgive me if I did things you didn't uh, see properly at the first step. I'd be more careful about explaining that later. So um, I've created a peg, Control P, linked it with the Alt and if what I want to do is that I want my FX to begin when my chicken is beginning to wipe out. So here is seems to be the good frame. So I am going to rotate my element because I want to animate the element along my wires. So I put center here and I would just rotate my element and as I really want it to appear properly I will do it like this okay rotation is here and I know that it disappears My last frame of FX is here, so let's say a few frames after, I will manage to make my element disappear totally. But as you can see, it appears now, and if I go to the first frame, oh, actually, I didn't animate, sorry, so. Let's do it again. Okay, 
so my element will appear inside this mask but I shall just transform it so let's say here right click on my element drawing and duplicate drawing so here I will remove part of it okay and let's proceed and from here I will duplicate again so alt shift D to create a new drawing and here I will make it disappear too okay so now I have this and next is to disappear okay so once I've done that I have my wires here and the mask and what I want to do is I want this mask to be seen only inside the wire mask I've created so let's go on my combine and use again the cutter as you notice cutter is one of the most important element inside harmony Oops, I think I did something wrong. Yes, I did something wrong. Yes, here it is. I did something wrong here. While put it up because I have no keyframe here for my position. So I need to add a keyframe of my position here and then move it up just to remove the small elements here okay let's do it again my cutter and say that my mask will be seen only inside the cutter okay now that I have this properly, I need to add a glow. So jump in the filter. Let's say I want a glow and I want it to be exactly the same. And 10 is a bit too much. Okay, let's say it is okay. And now I want another FX on it just to be nice is sparkles which is here and I want these sparkles to be seen on my elements and mask as you can see here there is a mask inside my element so I want a lot of sparkles really a lot I want it to be dense and I want it to be brightness but smaller oh as you can see they are too much let's reduce let's say this is okay oh as you can see it goes along with my fx so now if I go there it is going to disappear okay the wires FX is made okay now I did the small panel and I did the wires and now let's jump to the big screen